Greetings, Maggie Shed update. I've got the three walls up. Okay, wife helped me last night putting that third wall up. Uh, I had to cut a couple of branches off that tree as it uh, we couldn't quite get the that corner up. Uh, so it's a bit precarious and prone to wind, but uh, there isn't any, and there isn't any forecast for the next few days. But um, I only have three nights now before I'm going on holiday, so I really want to get the front wall up and um, front tied to back, etc. Uh, get it battened down. So I started on the left hand section, and this is the one with the big window. Did a sketch yesterday of what I'm going to put where. And thank you to Mr. Keith Bolton for sending me the guide to doing it proper, which I'm loosely following. That says use 4x2s, I'm using 3x2s. That says 400 centres, I'm using 600. It's only a shed after all. Um, now the issue my engineer friend is the uh, massive span over this window and the load it needs to take. So uh, with that in mind I've uh, got a length of 5x2 that way around to uh, take the load um, above the window. Um, door's going to be there. And after I built this last night for about three hours, uh, my wife said, Oh, could you not put the uh, big window on the right hand side? No. He had said that three hours earlier, baby, but I'm not taking it apart now. Uh, plus, that if I put the big window on this side, I won't be able to see out of it because we've got a tree in the way. Okay, so yeah, three nights to go, and then I have to go skiing. Haven't packed yet, so hopefully get this wall done, that wall done, and I'll get some temporary uh, temporary rafters over the top. Okay, that's all for now. Make a shit out. Good morning, all. Mega shed update. Not got as far as I'd have liked. So. I've got two nights yet to work, uh, but Friday night, I've got to get up at two in the morning to go skiing, so I don't think I want to be working too late. So I was eight till ten last night, uh, got this left hand half of the front wall built, um, the membrane on and the slater's buttons on, so that's pretty much ready to just go up, but I've yet to start on building the other end. Um, the wind apparently is going to be picking up from tonight, so um, once I get this up I'll make sure everything is uh, battened down because I'm not sure I'll get four walls up um, by Friday night. Uh, so then I'll just work on getting lots of struts out to brace it down. Um, should be able to tie the front wall to the back wall the left hand anyway, that should hold it fine. Uh, on the window, um, after my wife said she didn't want to see the massive window uh, on the left hand side, we came to a compromise, uh, decided we can cut down the the uh, double panel windows. So we'll have a small sash and <clears throat> top light opener on the right hand side and then I'll cut it off. The other one I'll cut off so that we'll just have a large pane here with uh, no sash open. Uh, so that's a compromise. It means I'll end up with a lot of window to get rid of afterwards, but we'll deal with that when I get to it. Um, yeah, the cladding didn't end up with much left, but I knew I had enough. Um, so it, the weather has got a bit damp, it's a bit annoying, but it could be worse. I'm uh, just waiting for the wind to come now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna set up a camera to so that when I'm uh, in France, I'll be able to see whether my shed's blown away. Not much I can do about it, mind, but there you go. Mega shed out. Evening all. Mega shed update. You know, I said a few days ago. It's not been very windy. 
don't think there's any wind forecast in the next few days. Well, Christ on a cracker, there's a storm coming. So, change of plan. I put up the wall, half wall that I built, uh, with a smaller window than planned. So that's done and fixed down. And I'm not going to try and build the second half of it because I need space to build it. But there's a storm coming in the morning, and on my advice from my engineer friend, I'm gonna brace the shit out of it. So, got lots and lots of braces, lots of screws. The base of this is gonna be like a Swiss cheese when I take them out. And got braces in the corners, triangles, and I'm just gonna leave it at that and uh, wait until I get back from holiday in a week's time so I'm afraid the mega shed updates are just probably gonna be stills from my uh, my garden camera so saying it's still there it's still there fingers crossed uh, so I'll uh, get back to you when I start work again mega shed out <laughs>